Hello beautiful makeup lovers, my name is Caroline, welcome to my channel. In today's video I will be sharing with you some new products I picked up at Nordstrom. The other day I went shopping and voila, this happened. I picked up a couple of La Rouge crayons, these are new this season. And of course a few Coco Rouge Flash lipsticks, this is the new formula. I had a couple that I really really like and this one is from the summer collection I only got one I thought I didn't like the others but I will come back because there was one color that was sold out specifically and I didn't try the other one but I will I also pick up new moon this is their cream eyeshadow and it's absolutely beautiful and the main reason I went to Nordstrom is because I ordered this eyeshadow like three times and every single time I would receive it, it would be kind of dry and it looked like it had been used. Finally, I said, no, I have to return it at the store and see if they have it. And here it is. It's absolutely beautiful. It's like purple with glitter and pink. I just love those kind of colors. Perfect for many looks and all year round. Now, let me show you the Coco Rouge colors. This one is in color 64 Ardent. It looks like this. The new Coco Rouge formula, I feel like it's more pigmented. You will still get that satin feel and your, your lips to be, to feel very, very soft, but it's more pigmented and the consistency is a little bit thicker and here it is now let me show you coca flash and 98 instinct and this is how it looks this is more on a maroon color and this is darker than that color this one is darker you can wear it during the day it's fine I would just prefer to use it more at night, but I would use it during the day either way, I don't mind. This one is in color 94, it looks like this, it's more like a, of a pinkish color. Oh god, I want the camera to focus, yeah, right there you can see it. These ones are lip crayons and this is how they come, and they are matte. I'm gonna do it right on the side of my hand. Look how it looks. How beautiful is that color? Absolutely beautiful. I'm not much of a matte lip person, but these ones, they don't feel like matte. They might look matte, but they don't. It's, it has a little tiny sheen and it feels very soft on the lips. Now this color is a little bit darker. This color is called 289 Black Current and it's darker, more of a berry color. And there you have it. Let's get started with this tutorial, shall we? I will start with my eyeliner, the cold liner, and I'm not gonna make it complicated. Just gonna draw right on the crease, my eyes shape, kind of exaggerating the outside. And with a double side brush from Chanel, I will blend that pencil color. And you kind of have to work fast. It gives you enough time to work on the eye, but still, you want to make sure that you have enough time to blend. Apply a little bit on your bottom lashes and with the other side. And with the other side, blend. And they're super creamy and easy to blend. It's a beautiful purple color. This color 
If you have green eyes, it's great. Now with my Le Beige palette, I will come to this color, which is like a maroon, brown color, and come on the outer, outer corner of my eyes, and kind of a smoke that area. This is a very easy and quick look. Now I will do the same thing with my bottom lashes. With my other brush, I go back there and intensify the outer corner of my bottom lashes, just the corners. Going to that new moon eye cream shadow, I will use my fingers. You can use a brush, it comes with a brush, but I prefer my fingers because it's less messy and it has a little bit of glitter. Well, actually a little glitter. It's absolutely beautiful. I think for brown eyes and green eyes, this combination is excellent. Clean those edges and voila, you're done. Now with a clean brush, I will go to my Le Beige palette and I use this kind of color to clean and blend those edges right here a little bit. With my black pencil from Chanel, I will intensify my eyelashes and of course, tie line. Now with my Chanel Le Valle Mascara, I will apply it to my eyelashes. And once I finish with my eyes, we'll move to finish the rest of the face and test those beautiful lip lipsticks. I forgot to mention that I had already uh, prepped my skin and applied my foundation and concealer before I start my eyes, but I applied this beautiful foundation, which is my favorite ultra latte, as you guys must know by now, along with my Chanel concealer and translucent powder. Now for contour, I will use the new summer collection uh, bronzer, which is the uh, bronzer and highlighter duo in medium. And this is a Bobbi Brown a small brush. I have to use a small brush because as you see, this color uh, right here is not very big, but it's a beautiful bronzer. Um, it's kind of like a cool tone, very subtle on the skin. And I will apply it right here on the highest point of my face. As you can see, it's very, very subtle, very nice. A little bit on my nose, the bridge of my on the sides to contour my nose a little bit. And I really, really enjoy this bronzer. It's very nice, as you can see, very natural. Now I'm gonna use the highlighter side with my Sonia G brush. This is a beautiful, beautiful highlighter. So you can see the glow like a sunshine, a little bit on the bridge of my nose. Now for my blush, I will use my beautiful Boyish de Chanel. I know it doesn't look as pretty anymore because it's been well loved. I've been giving it a lot of use. And I will mix these two colors right here. You can scroll, but for me in this case, I gotta use those two colors. And just to add a little bit, some color now that I finish with my face let's test these beautiful matte crayons and see how they look on the skin since I have two colors I will start with the light shade and I will line up my lips with it. 
very soft formula. This is very easy to use and I love the color. And this was color 287 Rosy Wood. It's beautiful. If you are darker than me, my complexion of light or light complexion, this is a beautiful color. Now this is color 289 Black Current. Now this is more of a burgundy color. This is absolutely beautiful. Love the shade, very creamy. I think I would do another eye look with this color because it's too bold for me. But overall, I love it. Now going into lighter shades, let me introduce you to the beautiful Coco Rouge lipsticks. Like I mentioned before, I went for the lighter shades to the darkest and purchased three colors. But I purchased this color, which you already saw on my previous video of Chanel Summer Collection. And I will link, if you didn't see it, I will link the video right here so you can see it. And it's a beautiful kind of like rosy mauve color, purple, very, very soft. This color came with the Cruise Collection for the summer. Now, this color with this eye makeup, yes, definitely a yes. It's softer. Now, very quickly, let me show you something very interesting. And the new formula, which is more intense and pigmented, the difference with the old one, this is an old uh, Coco Rouge lipstick, and this is the difference between the old one and the new. The design on the old one is just plain logo CC uh, white on black. While the new one, it has the transparent cup with the white uh, logo. It's like a gold, transparent, and white. I will show you real quick these two colors. This is uh, number 212, the one I'm wearing. And this is color 67, all formula. It's more sheer. And this is the difference between two colors, the two colors. I hope the camera can focus. And now here we have together the three colors that I showed before. The lightest pink for the day. Then we have the kind of reddish, pinkish color in the middle and the darkest shade for the night. Or afternoon or during the day is your preference. I will start applying the pink. This formula is perfect for my dry lips. And here's the color. Now the red color. And don't worry, I will leave everything linked down below for your convenience. Now the darkest shade from the three lipsticks. Obviously it's not a very dark shade, but for what I'm used to, since I wear a lot of nude colors, I also love reds, I love reds. I have a beautiful collection of red lipsticks. Maybe one day I will make a video showing my favorite red lipsticks. Well, I hope you guys have enjoyed the different color lipsticks on my lips. It was really fun for me to try that because I don't think I have ever done that myself. I usually, when I buy a couple different lipsticks, I would wear them one at a time, but I wouldn't just try it on just because. Now with this beautiful, 
cream eyeshadow, you can do so many looks. You can use a cold liner pencil, you can use any palette from Chanel or any other brand and just apply it. It's beautiful, I love it. You can kind of do like a smoky eye. This is a little bit a stronger than stronger look of what I'm used to doing on myself, but I really like it. I think it's beautiful and I love this kind of colors as well. I think I'm becoming more adventurous as time goes on. And before we finish this tutorial, we have to apply a little bit of Chanel number no. five. We can miss that. And I love this fragrance. It's my favorite. I must confess, I'm not loyal 100% to any fragrance, but this one I have worn for many, many years. And I think if it's to be loyal to a fragrance, this is it for me. My number one fragrance. It always, always sits on my vanity. Always. I will always love it. And with this, I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. I hope you liked it. Please follow me on social media, Instagram, CV Makeup Lover, so you see all the pictures I post of new makeup and looks uh, from my YouTube channel. And if you like this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up, subscribe, and I will see you next time. Thanks for watching.